All right, guys, we are back, and today we're going to be taking a look at another animatronic that they're putting out for 2024 from Spirit Halloween. This is not really a brand new one. This is a re-release. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Creepy Towering Clown. Now, I did notice right off the bat, if we're looking at the website here, they have it written down as the Towering Creepy Clown, which is really weird because when he first came out, he was called the Creepy Towering Clown. And from the pictures that I've seen of other people posting and putting videos on YouTube, even the brand new box for 2024 still says Creepy Towering Clown. But for some reason on the website here, it says Towering Creepy Clown. Kind of weird. This is one that I was really, really excited to see come back out. I remember seeing this guy in stores right alongside Hugs, and as you guys know, Hugs is like my favorite animatronic ever. The two of them together just look totally awesome. And not only is the creepy towering clown already towering, but they had him up on a platform when I first saw him. New Philadelphia, Ohio at that Spirit Halloween in the old JCPenney's. I remember walking by and just looking way up at this guy, just how tall he was and how creepy and scary he looked. So I was very, very happy to see him re-released this year. And I will be honest with you guys right now, I already bought him. He is on his way to my house. And as soon as I get him, I will be doing an unboxing video. But today we're going to go ahead and take a look at him here online because a lot of people have been requesting this. So over here on the website, yes, it is the six and a half foot towering creepy clown animatronic. This guy is absolutely huge. We have a couple pictures here. Not as many as with other animatronics. Usually there's like six or seven pictures. This one we have the first picture here where he's, I don't know, standing outside somewhere, probably outside a circus, has some fog going on. The next one is without the uh, background. And the last one is just to show you how tall he really is. Now I gotta say, that hair looks absolutely crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I do love his outfit. His hands. I'm curious to see how his hands are when I get this new one because it seems that I remember when he was in stores that his fingers were like really, really thin. There was just no thickness to those hands. Somebody like Crouchy, they have gigantic hands. But this guy, it seems like his hands were just really, really thin. So let's go back up here to the, uh, the picture of him with the background. I don't know, can we zoom in there? Yeah, a little bit. I love the look on his face right there. His eyes are glowing and he's just looking down with that sinister glare. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and read the description here, guys. I am so excited to get this guy. I can't wait till he comes in. With the carnival struggling to survive, Grimsley the Great has to take desperate measures. He's on the hunt to capture any unlucky bystander and turn them into his next freak show star. He lurks behind the curtain, waiting for a chance to snatch the next performer. Legend has it, he even sews their mouths shut with his bony claws so nobody can hear their screams. I wonder if that's referring to his fingers and how I just said they were so thin, maybe they're supposed to look like that. His head will turn while he shouts his creepy sayings. After all, the show must go on. Watch in horror as Grimsley turns from side to side, looking for his next innocent bystander. His eyes light up with yellow rage and his jaw chatters maniacally while he taunts his victims with a deadly game of hide and seek. So, he's the towering creepy clown, but apparently his name is Grimsley. All right, that's kind of strange that they would just call him the creepy towering clown instead of calling him Grimsley. Maybe it, I don't know, maybe it just didn't make sense to do that or something. Personally, I think Creepy Towering Clown sounds better. So let's go ahead, he does have a video with him here. And let's go ahead and watch this video. I'm starting a new juggling act. I'll need a hand from one of you. And a head, and a foot, oh, any part will do. <laughs> Oh, that's it. We only get to hear one of his phrases. He has several, including, I'm looking for someone to play hide and seek with. You go hide and I'll come find you. Start running. And then, oh, okay, his third 
and final saying is, ha 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 ha. Okay. <laughs> I do like how in the video he has um, a balloon. Let's just watch that again here. I'm starting a new juggling act. I'll need a hand from one of you. And a head. And a foot. Oh, any part will do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love that ginormous red balloon that he has. I'm definitely going to have to get one of those for him. And he also has, like, a string light on the string of the balloon. So I think I can go to the Dollar Tree and get string lights for $1.25, battery-operated string lights, and, uh, and I can make it look exactly like that. That would be so cool. But as for now, he is $2.29.99, and you can get 20% off. Like, if you guys go onto the website to buy any animatronic or really anything, and they are not offering 20% off, Put them in your cart and just wait a day or two. They will send you an email and say, hey, you forgot something in your cart. Will 20% off help? And so they will give you that 20% off. Good way to save some money on an animatronic. I know everybody's in a hurry to get them, but dang, man, I mean, 20% is 20%. Okay, so this is a pretty short video here, but yeah, I just wanted to take a look at the Creepy Towering Clown because a lot of people have been asking me if I'm going to do this one while I'm looking at the new animatronics for this year. And as I said, I did order him. He is on his way to my house. So as soon as I get him, I will be doing an unboxing video. I personally can't wait. Let me know what you guys think of the Creepy Towering Clown. What do you think about that other name, Grimsley? That's kind of weird. But give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, and make sure you're subscribed because we have an entire season of Halloween ahead.